Welcome to Time to Replay Castlevania Part 5. We are now in the fifth level. Close to the end here. Uh, of course, gotta deal with these ignoring. Ignoring. Annoying hunchbacks of Notre Dame. See, I wish I could ignore them. Of course, I can't ignore them because I'm in ECW mode. That was crazy hard. Love the track, though. Awesome track. Man, these guys are more harder than Assignment's Quest. Man, skeletons everywhere in this level. Whoa, it's a giant dungeon gate there. Man, it's annoying midges again. And these red skeletons that won't die. Man, we're in the depths of Dracula's dungeon or castle now. Come on, there, there you go. Go through the Goonie door. This castle looks real similar to the final castle, final area in Simon's Quest. Oh man, these knights with the boomerang axes. A boomerang axe, that's pretty scary. Come on, jeez. Oh, Huh. Speaking of axe, I got his axe. And we've got coffins now up there. Do enemies come out of those coffins? I don't remember. No, they don't. Just got to deal with the red respawning. Not spawning, but com coming back to life skeletons again. in the background there it's like weird giant light bulbs jeez oh, yeah the stage is I like how the stage is designed it really is designed to be really creepy in its own Castlevania-esque way oh, come on yes yeah there you go A red skeleton trying to do walk like a pimp. Of course, you can't have a level in Castlevania without these things. Whoa, the red skeleton almost got me there. Ah, oh, dang it, but it got me there. Ah, oh, jeez, I forgot they can come back to life. <laughs> dang. All right. Uh, of course, the Medusa heads again. Now, like I said, I've never gotten this far legit, so I cannot imagine what it's like to play this part legit. I never got this far as a kid, but I cannot imagine having to deal with this stuff. When I was a kid, this made me so freaking mad. Because I did rage a lot at games that were hard and were kicking my butt. I mean, the Medusa heads, the nice axe boomerangs, jeez. Three things are certain in life. Death, taxes, and me beating this level because I got ECW mode. Haha. <laughs> Yeah, I'm cheating right here, so I'm going to cheat death. Look how hard this is. Man. I 
can't imagine it beating death legit, man. This is, this is hard. I'm sure there is a good strategy, but man, I just don't know it. And uh, apparently this is not it. But again, who cares? Because I'm in ECW mode. I'm gonna pwn death right here. I'm gonna just laugh at death. <laughs> what are you gonna do? That's right, I'm invincible. I got eternal life in this game. All these scathes coming after me. Jeez, look at that. It just came out of nowhere. Look at that. Death is dead, but the skates can still hit you. Or skies, whatever they're called. The sky's the limit with ECW mode. That's so cheap, though. Imagine being in that situation, which I'm sure some of you gamers have, where you beat death right here. The sky, or whatever it's called, can still kill you after death is dead. Oh, extra life. Even though that doesn't matter here. All right, so that is the end of part five. I'll see you guys in the last part with the last level. Until then, God bless and take care.